Hi guys, welcome to the channel. Quick general reading for my friends Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus. Whenever you watch this, take what resonates and leave what doesn't. If you resonate, let us know, like, share and subscribe to the channel. Thank you for the support. So guys, let's find out what's coming through for you. Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus in the Love Arena. Let's see what we can get for you guys. We are ready to go. So, your energies, guys, the High Priestess and the Tower. Your person's energies, Eight of Cups, Two of Wands. Meeting energies, Ten of Pentacles and the Nine of Wands. Hierophant energy, bottom of the deck, um, a major arcana about partnerships, um, committed relationships. That it is fair to say usually are built on solid grounds but uh, this flow of energies is um, pretty straightforward and it is about a situation that is involving um, a crossroads a decision that can um, lead towards the opportunity to move um, separate ways to go separate ways king of cups uh, bottom of the hierophant so uh, emotional maturity with the king of cups sometimes for me he can struggle a little bit with the communication part um, and there is a touch of silence uh, involved because of the a priestess at the same time, the decision can be based on a deep awareness. It seems a uh, conscious and kind of uh, kind of uh, reciprocal agreement, I would say. So, guys, let's go for these energies. Um, the yeah, Priestess and the Tower, this is the change that follows a um, deep evaluation. Because the yeah, Priestess is an energy about a quiet moment. She is in touch with the higher world. Um, she knows everything, but she speaks only the essentials. And she trusts her intuition, even in order to uh, discover and understand things that can um, slip away in the rush of the everyday life. And it seems that the tower can be considered as uh, not just the, the ending about a connection, so the crumbling down of a situation, um, but also some type of realization, um, a light bulb moment, a meaningful understanding about a situation that for whatever reason um, may have created overwhelming emotions and even challenging situations. But it seems that because of the A-Priestess and because of the factor involved with the King of Cups, the communication for some of you is uh, something that is yet to uh, be manifested. There is an evaluation, you know. What are we going to do? And this resonates also with the Two of Wands, which is in the in the energies of some of your persons. So the tower can be a revolutionary change and if it is a committed uh, partnership, even a marriage for some of you because of the Ten of Pentacles, uh, the tower can truly be a, a powerful change. A situation as it was will completely be different moving forward.
this is a mature decision um, as challenging as it may be because we have the Hierophant, we have the A Priestess, we have the King of Cups and so this is not a, this is not a call to action that can um, pop up overnight, you know? There is a deep evaluation, a deeper understanding and for some of your persons guys um, they are willing to embrace the crossroads because there is the eight of cups involved and um, this is about someone that is willing to leave behind a situation for me this um, energy is about a uh, a brave decision because this man is willing to leave behind eight cups to go all out on an adventure pursuing his own ultimate emotional fulfillment because previously uh, again for reasons that can be um, so different it wasn't possible to fulfill heart and soul the moon in the background for this energy works like the a priestess for some of you it's a deep evaluation even the necessity to overcome a certain fear factor because if it is a partnership a marriage a committed relationship and we are evaluating the opportunity to go separate ways it's a brave call it's a major challenge because there are consequences moving forward that we will need to take care of and the two of ones is an energy that follows along because this man is holding the world in his hand so is life for me and he is evaluating all the aspects involved in a particular scenario in a particular uh, situation so that he can take notice of all the factors that can play a role and it can make the best possible decision moving forward this is not an easy one guys and if it is not your story of course you uh, you leave the messages here but uh, meeting of the energies we see the ten of pentacles that goes along with the hierophant it's um, an established connection um, a source of satisfaction and it may have been uh, in its early stages uh, in the development but then something has happened something that can be related to the challenges of the everyday life uh, difficult situation or situations that may have uh, popped up you know along the journey and so right now um, some of you may still be involved of course in the uh, everyday life as a couple others of you may have already entered the stage where the tower is manifesting so this energy is a uh, memory and you are taking care of a lot of things particularly overwhelming and challenging because we see the nine of wands so the wounded warrior someone that has gone through quite a lot of challenges and the point with the nine of wands for me is about the fact that this man is telling us the story about his bravery he has found a way to power through to endure and to persevere throughout all the challenges that he has faced and in the process he has learned quite a lot about himself and about the journey there is a learning curve because of the a priestess guys and because of the hierophant also um, because this is an energy that can resonate with uh, lessons and it's tough I'll be honest with you because um, this Hierophant and the Ten of Pentacles uh, seems a combination that um, was built on shared values but this tower is quite um, is quite powerful because a deep evaluation about something that may have been even unexpected has caused has called for um, 
major decision and despite how challenging it may be it seems um, a mutual decision it's kind of like two persons can agree about the fact that um, a cycle is expired and we need to move forward pursuing the adventure even by going uh, separate ways so taking care of the tasks and duties defenses are up but for protection so in a way that can help to ease a little bit the energies uh, when it's possible to do so but this is a major um, a major crossroads and it does not seem to be an easy one for those that can resonate but I just want to say that I know the meaning about the tower and it can be super challenging but it is also the path to the star which is about hope healing and possibly some type of uh, different opportunity to fulfill wishes and so guys um, I will leave it at that for now I truly hope it was helpful I'll continue on Vimeo I'll see you there if you want to join me the link is below let us know if you resonate comment like share subscribe to the channel until next time I wish you the best guys take very good care of you and I will talk to you soon bye